So we often get asked, do your stalker decoys attach to longbows and recurves? And the answer is absolutely yes. In fact, they attach much easier than they do to compounds. And to demonstrate this, I'd like to bring this up here and show you a little bit of what I've done here. We've taken two out of the three Velcro straps and we have wrapped the limb of the bow. And so I've, done, I've used one strap above the shooting window, one strap below the shooting window. But I'd like to pull this off of here and elaborate on a couple elements. Each one of these Velcro straps that come with it is about, about the size of a ruler, one inch by 12 inches. And there's one very, very important thing when you're wrapping it, and that is to overlap. So what I'm gonna do is, and also, I'll tell you one little trick that I like to do. I like to start this actually up a little bit higher, and I'll show you why here in just a second. But I'm gonna mash here, and then I want to make sure an overlap right there as much as possible. I'm going to wrap it around and I'm going to overlap again as many times as it will allow. Now I mentioned that I like to start it up a little bit higher and this is why. I like to be able to pull this and as it gets larger it gets nice and snug. It's much easier to do that than it is to wrap it really tight right there. That's all you have to do. You do that at the top, you do that at the bottom, and then you get ready to attach it. And the wonderful thing about our decoys is we know that you trad guys need as big of a sight window as possible. So we made this patch as big as we could. This allows you the opportunity to move left and right. It even allows you to cheat a little bit whenever you guys can't your bow, you're able to tip the decoy a little bit to knock off the edge a bit. But you're just gonna attach at the top, you're gonna attach at the bottom, and that's it. You're ready to hunt, the rest is the fun part. Now, traditional equipment with our Spire reps is insanely easy. I don't, I don't have this bow strong here, but you would get the idea. All I have done is attach the spider wrap and twist it down as tight as I can. The nice rubber on here will allow grip. Plus, as you guys all know, the bows usually get larger as they go this direction. So it'll allow a little bit of compression there. But I've just twisted it down as tight as I could on there. And then I took that extra, moved it around so I could have the little bit of stability on the decoy. I'm going to do that at the top. I'm going to do that at the bottom. And you're good to go. It's that simple. The nice thing about this is, is that you can actually offset our decoys at an angle, uh, offset the decoys, turn them to an angle if you like to cant the bow. You have a lot of real estate on the back of each one of our decoys to move it around for you guys, you uh, traditional archers. But extremely simple, extremely quick, and extremely quiet. Now, let's discuss how our spider wraps attach to crossbows. Now, keep in mind that it's almost the exact same thing as attaching it to a compound. I mean, everybody knows it's like this. Now we just went like that. Same principles. You want to run it through. You want to make as much contact with the bow as possible. If you have additional left over, you can use it for stability. You can use it on the top or maybe twist both of them to the bottom if you want additional stability on the bottom. But you just need to find a good balance point for the decoys. Now, I don't know if you guys have noticed this or not, but the um on each side of the shooting window there is also a loop here and that is where you're going to attach the uh crossbow or uh, i'm sorry attach the decoy to the crossbow this one thing that you have to do is make sure that you position it exactly perfectly so that the bolt does not come in contact with the decoy you need to find the balance point what's nice for it you can use additional uh the additional uh, tie extra part of the tie to stabilize it if you need to, but super simple. And I do want you to keep in mind that our de decoys do not attach to reverse draw crossbows. If it's a standard crossbow, then you're just fine. But again, you just need to get your crossbow, uh, work with it, play with it, test it a little bit, see what works best for you. Super simple and super effective. Feel free to check out our full line of stalker decoys at ultimatepredatorgear.com.